Hey, gun people and horsey people. Uh, somebody wanted me to uh, review this thing. So they sent me two of these little cameras and, um, and a Wi-Fi extender. Now this is the uh, for Foscam, Forcecom. I thought they said Forcecom when I listened to the video, but maybe I was wrong. Um, this is the G2 1080. It says 49 each. They sent me two of these and a um, Wi-Fi extender. The Wi-Fi extender, man, it worked freaking crazy good. I mean, my place... I, I, what I did is I put the camera in my car after I hooked it up inside and then I have a little plug-in where I can plug it in in the car because it needs power. So that's, that you know, when you're out in the country, having power is one of the key things. You've got to have power. And my gateway out there, I use solar. So I'm assuming I could get me a little solar plug-in and then plug it in uh, at my gate. But my gate is so far away. I mean, it's way out there. And uh, I'll slide in a picture on how far it is. I want to say it's uh, 300 yards. Now, this thing says it, it goes out. Where was the, the mileage here? What it extended to? It said somewhere. I thought it was like 200 and something feet but distance. Anyway, it went a lot further than it said it did. I mean, it was now. I put it in the window. And I'll slide in a little picture now to where I show it. So it's right in my window and it's a line of sight to my driveway. But, uh, man, it is a long way. I mean, it's good grief. Um, I, like I said, it's a quarter of a mile down there and back. I know when I walk it, it's a quarter of a mile down and back. Uh, so it's an eighth of a mile. So do the math. Uh, but the extender, man, it gave me a signal all the way. I put it inside the car, and I drove all the way to my driveway, and I still was getting a signal on this camera. So it's very easy. I think you're going to get a good connection if you get this. Now, there is a... Um, let me. So they're promoting this as a horsey thing because of the coronavirus. People are stealing horses and cattle and cattle mutilation and all this other stuff. So with this little thing here and if you if you use the link I'm gonna put in a video I think you get an additional five percent off uh, on top of this already pretty good deal now look I didn't pay for it but they didn't tell me that I had to say I like it or I dislike it so evidently you have to put this code and uh, hopefully the link will either take you to this code you want it to go here but if the link doesn't fix it if you go to the, their website and uh, you can get this code here and it will it's for you got to buy at least two cameras and the extender so two of these cameras um, would normally be a hundred bucks and then I think the extender is also a hundred bucks or no 50 bucks so it'd be 150 bucks just straight price if you bought it from Amazon but I think if you put that group code it knocks almost 50 percent off so you're looking at two cameras and an extender for less than a hundred bucks, which is pretty damn good. Um, so, look, if you want to, uh, if you want to try this, I think this extender works like a champ. Um, and I mean, it it went far. Again, I put it in the window in a straight line of sight, and you get two. A couple of things that I didn't like on the. Um, let me see. I think I did a screenshot. So here's how I set it up in the car. I just set it on here and then plugged it into my little, uh, I got a little plug right here. And um, now a couple things that I'm not a fan of. It's got a lot of these wires here and it says it's got audio and speaker. But it's kind of misleading a little bit because you have to plug in an external audio and speaker. On this camera, they may make another camera to where it's it's concluded. But on this camera you have to plug in a microphone and a speaker. And I don't really need a microphone and speaker, to be honest. Uh, if you're just setting this up for your animals, I don't need to talk to my animals, and I don't need to talk to somebody. The other thing about this is you can get it to where it ignores your animals and it only picks up humans, which is pretty cool. So I've got a, I've got a, another ca couple cameras set up that are a pain in the butt to connect, and uh, so I'm just going to change them to these two and put them uh, at my front door and my horses used to set off the motion and now I can turn set these to where it doesn't 
And I had Smokey walk by to see if it was going to pick him up, and it didn't. And then I walked by, picked me up. So uh, you can you can tune it off for animals. Uh, hang on, another picture. So here you can tell I took a picture. Here's a little Wi-Fi I've got it set up in the window for the extender. Uh, so I have this extender set up right here, and my driveway is like 330, maybe 330 feet. Oh man, it's freaking long. I always get it screwed up, but. It's out there. Like I said, it's a quarter of a mile from where you're looking at down on my driveway and back. It's one quarter of a mile. So, and I drove all the way down here to where these trees are at, and I still had signal with this extender. Now, without the extender, I lost signal about right here in the driveway. So just regular, I got here. But as soon as I put the extender on, it went all the way down here. So the extender definitely works if you need distance. You may not need the distance. I had pretty good reception. If you've got line of sight with your internet, you may not need the extender. Now they do try to push the, the cloud service for three days. It says 39. I, 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 I want to think it comes out to 399 a month. Uh, I hate monthly fees and, and I don't like that storage. Now you can put a card in there. Mine didn't come with a card. Uh, I will probably end up putting a card, but, you know, they keep saying the cloud's free. Well, it's free for seven days, and then they want to charge you this. So if you want the cloud, that's fine. Uh, it definitely notifies you pretty quick. As soon as I move, I get notification on my phone within, I'm going to say, three to four seconds. So it, it's pretty good about picking up when I move in front of the camera. So if you want to try it, hey, don't come crying to me about... It's too hard. Look, when I hook this thing up, it says you can hook it up by plugging it in directly to your Wi-Fi. And I did, and it hooked up fine. It's got a great little scan code on it to where you just take right underneath the camera here. There's a little, uh, hang on, I'll snap a picture. So when it comes out of the box, it's got this sticker. I'll, I'll fuzz out probably all this stuff. But uh, this little code right here, all you do is put that on a phone. Now you have to download the the force cam or FOSCAM app and then once you get the app running it says add new camera and then you come and you scan this code and it puts in all the info and gives you the camera so it's really really simple to set up when it comes out of the thing all you have is you screw in this antenna and then um, I plugged it straight into my Wi-Fi and set it up one where it was hardwired and then I set up one to where it was Wi-Fi and both of them were just as easy so it says it recommends to do the hard wire. Uh, now, I hardwired it to do the firmware update. And as soon as I got them, I did a firmware update on both of them. And it supposedly works with Alexa, but I haven't tried it or connected it yet. Um, pretty cool little system. So if you want to do it for your horses, for your animals, or just for your property, I'm going to post this on my gun channel because I think it's a good security system just, just to have because it picks up people. And, uh, you know, I can turn it off for animals because with my horses and cats and rabbits and everything else running around out here, I get a lot of false alerts. So this only picks up people, which is kind of cool. Um, and like I said, I, I think with the discount code, I couldn't get a complete price. Uh, but I think it's going to be under 100 bucks for two cameras. Um, they got night vision. They got pretty good quality. You can take a snapshot from your phone. Again... The downside is you got to pay if you want the storage or you got to buy a card. If you want audio uh, to be able to talk and to listen, you got to plug in a microphone and a camera yourself. But if you just want camera and you just want motion detector and you want the little app that notifies you, pretty stinking cool. And the, the Wi-Fi extender, man, I was like, holy cow, that sucker goes far. So anyway... um. If you want to try it, cool. If some of you guys, you know, want to put comments, the bad and the good, um, you know, I can pass that on to the guy that sent me this and uh, give him some input. But, I mean, you know, I'm nobody. Hell, they just, they figured they'd give me this and let me do a review. So I said, sure, I'll review it. So I reviewed it, and I like it. Pretty cool. All right. Well, then that there.